Hey everyone, this is Tanya at NV Property Management. Being in the property management industry can definitely have its fair share of horror stories. Since starting NV Property Management in 2015, we certainly haven't been exempt for our, from our own book of stories that will be told for years to come. Today, I want to share with you our top three property management horror stories. All right, story number one is the unannounced landlord. One of the first properties we signed on was a takeover from another property management company. During management with the previous management company, the property owner was considering selling the home. During this process, he contacted the property manager and asked if they would coordinate with the tenants so he and his realtor could tour the duplex to get a better understanding of what their asking price could be. The property manager coordinated a day and time and then gave the owner and the realtor keys to let themselves inside. The pair knocked on the tenant's door and after no one answered, they proceeded to enter the home, only to be swiftly kicked out by the tenant who was currently in the shower. All parties involved were embarrassed and horrified. The owner ultimately decided not to sell the property, but quickly switched management companies and called Envy Property Management to take over management moving forward. In this scenario, the management company should have properly notified the tenants of the day and time frame someone would be entering the premises. The notice should have been clearly posted on the door of the home with all the information necessary to enter the property legally. Secondly, the management company should never hand out keys to anyone to enter the property unaccompanied. Someone from the management company should always escort any individuals regardless of their interest in the home. All right, story number two is the MIA management company. Another unfortunate property management horror story happened several years ago when Envy Property Management started getting several frantic phone calls from property owners. They were stating that their management company had stopped paying them their monthly rent distributions. Many of these property owners were out of state and even out of the country and unable to track down anyone from their management company to find out what was going on. Come to find out their management company not only took off with several months of their rental income, but they also took off with the tenant security deposits as well. The management company was nowhere to be found and no one was able to get in contact with them. They were completely off the grid. These poor property owners were not only without their rent distributions for months, but they were also stuck holding the bill for funding their tenant security deposits as well. This is a perfect example of you get what you pay for. Many rental property owners will shop management companies purely based on who is the cheapest. This may seem like the best option at first, but in reality, there's definitely a reason they're pushing their inexpensive rates. Don't get suckered into hiring a management company based on their fees alone. Do your due diligence and make sure you research the company you are hiring to manage your asset. All right, lastly, story number three is called The Drug House. My fondest horror story of being a bad DIY landlord happened to myself. When my husband and I purchased our first investment property in Idaho about 20 years ago, it was a 1970s single wide trailer. Being a new DIY landlord and completely uneducated in the industry, we did the ultimate sin and did not screen our new tenants. We just let them move on in. These new tenants stayed for about six months, six months and then suddenly quit paying rent. After months of back and forth, we ultimately were able to evict them, but not after hours of time wasted, multiple trips to Idaho, and having to go to court to recoup our lost rent. That wasn't the best part, though. Once these tenants were finally out of the home, we went over there to assess the damages, which were pretty extensive. But the best and most memorable part of this experience was they left us a huge surprise in the backyard, a nice big marijuana plant. 
not only only were we out our rent income, but we now had to call the police and have this plant legally removed by the drug task force. While there are hundreds of rental property horror stories out there, they don't need to be a part of your storybook too. Leave the dirty work to a professional property management company like Envy Property Management. We have years of experience and can take the headaches of being a landlord out of your hands. Please contact us today at NV Property Management. We are a wealth of information when it comes to professional management of your investment property. You can always ask us for valuable tips and extra resources to make the choice simple and painless. Give us a call at 801-337-4337 or visit our website at nvpm.com. That's E-N-V-Y-P-M where you can easily view our three-tiered pricing plan so you can choose the package that best fits you and your needs. Thanks for watching today's video. We will see you guys next time.